Uh, thanks, Ken. It's exciting to see Netmarble Monster bringing Mongil Stardive to the Epic Game Store exclusively at launch on PC and taking advantage of our Epic First Run program to keep 100% of the first six months of net revenue. As you know, our industry is living through significant headwinds right now, and the Epic Game Store offers all developers a toolkit for maximum financial success that starts with our 8812 rev share and just gets better from there. Now on Epic, our back catalog program, like Epic First Run, allows you to keep 100% of net revenue for the first six months on back catalog titles that you bring to the Epic Game Store. And for Unreal developers, Launch Everywhere with Epic reduces your engine royalty rate from 5% to 3.5% on all platforms and stores when you ship your UE-based games day and date on the Epic Game Store. And remember, Unreal Engine developers pay 0% royalty on all Epic Game Store sales where we process payment. Additionally, you also have the option to use any in-app purchase payment solution you want, and when you do, you keep 100% of that IAP revenue. We want to do everything we can to help during this critical time to maximize your success, so we have added another tool to the Epic Game Store toolkit. Starting June 1st, we've changed our initial revenue share to 0% so that you receive 100% of the first million dollars in net revenue, and then 12% to Epic after passing that threshold. <laughs> Pretty cool, yeah, awesome. Um, and this change is per title and per year. So this applies to new titles and back catalog releases and all existing and future Epic Game Store partners and their titles on both PC and mobile benefit from this change immediately. And so life to date, we've paid our developer and publishing partners over $2.1 billion, and we're just getting started. So let's talk a little bit about what's next. So even after years of building the store on PC, we know there's still a ton of work to be done to deliver a world-class experience for our over 70 million monthly active users. And in the coming months, we'll be rolling out long overdue features on PC that will move us closer to that vision. Download Manager 2.0 was released just a few weeks ago, and preloading is coming finally in September. Uh, gifting is targeting a release in time for the holidays so, so that you can gift games to your friends. And our revamped social is rolling out this year and will connect our PC and mobile players together with game-independent voice chat, text chat, and parties, along with robust game invites for third-party games. And this will be the building block for several innovative social features on the store that will follow. We're also putting great focus on ongoing launcher improvements that will make the store feel great to use. And of course, delivering a great player experience means meeting players wherever they are, which is why mobile remains a key focus for us. We've already seen strong momentum on mobile with over 40 million installs to date, and we're pushing hard to hit 70 million by the end of the year. The Epic Game Store is available globally on Android, and we are continuing to expand our global footprint on iOS. Today, it's available on iOS in the European Union, with upcoming launches in Brazil, the UK, and Japan as new laws in those countries come into effect. In Q1, we launched with a curated selection of third-party titles, and as of, as of today, there are over 70 games live on the Epic Game Store mobile, with more being added regularly. This deliberate, phased approach ensures a high-quality experience as we gear up to open the store to self-publishing in the near future. In March, to accelerate installs and to keep players coming back week after week, we brought our weekly free games program to mobile. So each week, as we do on PC, we are partnering with developers to give players at least one new free game directly through the app on both Android and iOS, celebrating the best of premium mobile, and partnering with developers on content packs for free-to-play games. Our focus is getting the Epic Game Store mobile to 1.0. This is defined by two major new additions to the store, and the first of which is rolling out very soon. We're launching Epic Web Shops in July. Developers will be able to come into our tools and easily set up a shop for in-app purchases for mobile and PC games. And through Epic Web Shops, you can leverage our industry-best rev share and offer players a better deal with bonus offers. And as an extra benefit, all players spending on Epic Web Shops also accrues Epic rewards on all purchases. These shops will live on the web so that you can steer your players to them. And we're democratizing web shops by making them super easy to set up and available to all developers. And second, we'll be launching mobile self-publishing tools in Q4 and opening up the store to all mobile developers to set up and distribute your games.